Ladies and gentlemen, I present you the new Militao 2.0. Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to our brand new FIFA 22 video. This is Leo here bringing you another Spat Shot Player Review. And today, guys, we are going to be looking at UCL Road to the Knockouts, Luca Berissimo da Silva. Known as Lucas Veresimo, Veresimo, whatever. I'm going to mispronounce his name in this review. So I do apologize up front. I already know it, guys. I just have a feeling. But, oh my goodness, what a fantastic center back card. And only for 20k, man. If you have a Brazilian side, I know you're jumping off of joy. And if you're a Benfica fan or Portuguese league fan, this is a big time a W, guys. Lucas Beresimo, one of the most hyped cards in the game at the start of the year. Gets himself an 82 rated card and looks Phenomenal. He's 6'2", low, medium, right footed, 2 star skill moves, 2 star weak foot, and he is under 25k. That is ridiculous. And look at the card you are getting, guys. 83 pace, 82 acceleration, 84 sprint speed. You'll love to see that. Um, definitely going to be applying probably an anchor chemistry style. I think that is the way to go, but obviously shadow would be the number one. I just don't think I have one in the club, and they might be extinct at the moment, but I'll definitely do check. We'll check my club in a bit. I have a couple of untradeable uh, tradable pl players that I do have to sell before the before the consumables start popping up. I've been trading a lot this week. But let's go to the passing guys of 65, 80, short passing, 82, long passing, great passing, 4 and 82 rated card. The dribbling, the 53, agility, 60 balance. Hopefully it's a case of like a Varane where he feels faster than the agility and balance says and he feels very good side to side uh, definitely will let you know if that is an issue in the gameplay portion of the review we'll go on to the 83 reactions phenomenal the 76 composure does worry me just a little bit because for composure on your center backs you definitely do need to uh, have it higher just so he can perform uh, under pressure in my opinion some people don't really care but for me I, I do care about the composure on a center back the dribbling of 80 the dribbling guys oh my goodness I gotta wake up the defending of 83 83 interceptions 84 defensive awareness 81 standing tackle really good also will get increased with the chemistry style and lastly the physicality of 82 he brings the aggression which is a phenomenal thing to see at 87 the 82 strength he can definitely hold his own in the jumping as well he is 6-2 so he should win headers hopefully we get a heading goal i know uh corner goals are more prevalent this year so hopefully with lucas verissimo definitely we can do that the player traits is a long passer and i can definitely tell that because of that 80 short and 82 long passing but anyways i will conclude today's introduction for lucas verissimo is he worth it is he not is he militao 2.0 those are going to be some of the big questions we're going to be answering next all right guys come on first time playing with pepe and berimiso as well so both there we go vamos berimiso there we go covering that pass right there really good let's see his ball control right now almost can he outrun bar cam yes he can can he outrun Be Dembele? Yes, he can. Oh, my goodness, guys. He's fast. You see that burst of speed and that beautiful pass? No. Yeah, I, I, I got him out of position, but we're good, guys. Uh, the pace is there for the dribbling, for sure. Let's see if we can get a goal here. Vamos, Rodrigo. Vamos, Rodrigo. Do the skill. All right, come on, Benimiso. Feels really fast. Good AI blocking. Good reactions. And we got the ball back. Dale. So far, he feels really uh, good side to side movement for sure, man. Vamos, Veremiso. Vamos, Veremiso. There we go. Covering that pass to perfection. And we're on through. We're on through. Vamos, que buen pase para Ronaldo. Can he get there? Yes, he can. Se viene Cristiano. Cristiano! Goal, 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 goal. Cantala, cantala, cantala. Yes, out of. A defensive play from Beremiso. Cristiano Ronaldo puts it in the back of the net. That is what you love to see, guys. Defense turning into offense. We're up to one, guys. Vamos. Keep doing your stuff, Beremiso. Oh, my goodness. Pepe, what are you doing, Beremiso? Saving him right there. I stayed quiet because I thought I was surely a goal from Burkamp, but Berimiso's pace definitely helped him out there, man. Vamos, Berimiso. 
Why do you auto switch? There we go. Knocking down. I believe that's money, if I'm not mistaken. That's that strength right there. Great pass to Cristiano Ronaldo. Can we score a goal, though? Come on, Cristiano. Cristiano. All right, come on. Against Dembele. Look at the pace, guys. Against Dembele. Keeping up right there. Covering the pass. Covering the lane. Again, set a side movement. I am recovering, and we got the ball back, guys. That's not possible without his pace, man. Let's see the header. Look at that high jump. Oh, my goodness. He, he climbed on his back. And another goal, guys. Another goal by Ronaldo. And we're up 4-1. Look at that. He's even making that run right there. Let's see if we can get a bow. Oh, ahí está. Ahí está. Ahí. What a pass, guys. Goal, goal, goal. There we go. We got lucky. This game has been... Very lucky for us. Uh, we, we're getting all the BS goals. So I'll take it, guys. For once in a while, the BS doesn't happen to me. Betty Miso, UCL card gets himself an assist. And we are winning 5-2. Brazilian to Brazilian. And I'm loving this card, guys. Vamos. Betty Miso, there we go. On Lukaku. Look on Lukaku. All right, somebody make the run. Let's see. Is he through ball meta material? What a pass. Ah, yeah, yeah. He just gets the ball back. Vamos, 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 vamos. Come on, guys. Look at Verissimo. Can he get another assist? No, he can't, but I love that high pressure right there, man. He's defending on the other side of the pitch. But, I mean, it's good with me, guys. There we go, ready to see me. Oh my goodness. But now we're doing Scorpion assist or something. Great defense right there on Lukaku, one of the best headers in the game. Great defending, that's why I like his height as well. He's jumping too. Can lead to a goal though? Ah, I know I can't. Vamos, ready to see me against Lukaku. Vamos, the pace. The pace to catch up to Sterling. Beautiful right there, man. This is why you get these type of cars with the high pace, guys. Defend the corner. There we go. Con el pecho, chico. Con el pecho. There we go. Nice. Nice, man. We're losing 4-1. And honestly, it's because of Pepe. That's all I got to tell you. First time playing with Pepe as well. And I am not impressed whatsoever, guys. Bueno, Rodrigo, vamos, Pepe. Come on, bro. You got to carry the weight. Verissimo. Great ball control. Great movement. Great switch of play right there. We're going to build it with patience and Neves, guys. Also, why I'm, I'm playing with 57 pace Neves, I have no idea. Vamos. There we go. Vamos, Alan, con huevos. There we go. Nice AI blocking right there. At least Beremiso, Lodi are playing. Pretty good. Beremiso. Valverde. Nice. Nice, Beremiso, man. This has to be Militao 2.0, guys. Phenomenal, phenomenal games from Lucas Bericimos. Road to the knockout card. You love to see it, man. Phenomenal stuff, like I said. So let's go straight into the pros. Number one is going to be the 83 pace, man. The uh, acceleration and sprint speed help him out tremendously. I did have an anchor chemistry style on him. And yeah, you can definitely feel he is fast, man. I had a bad time with Pepe these two games. I know he's probably better than that. But uh, for me, he really wasn't that good. So Bericimo had to... 
you know, catch up with a lot of defenders that Pepe would uh, let go, especially on through ball metas. So having a very high paced center back like this uh, Brazilian beast is definitely a big plus and I have to include it as a pro. Another pro is going to be the 83 reactions. He reacts to interceptions, defensive plays. No complaints there. The 87 aggression as well, guys. He brings the aggression on the pitch and you love to see it. I knew that was going to be a big pro even before playing with this card. And definitely he is, it is shown on the pitch. The defending of 83, guys. Phenomenal as well. And his passing is top tier. I know he has a long passing trade, I believe. If I'm not mistaken. And you can definitely uh, be comfortable passing with this card. Because he will put it accurately to your midfielders or strikers. And he might even get an assist, guys. But on to the cons. The only con on this card that I can think of right now. Is probably going to be the 76 composure. The agility and balance weren't a con. I did not feel it at all. He's kind of the case, like I said, and predicted like a Baran where he has low agility and low balance where you don't really feel it. And with this Betty Simo card, you definitely don't. And I want to the Leo tips. I think the best links for him are Marquinhos and Militao. Go Brazilian with this card because I think that is how you're going to maximize your defense. Pepe it wasn't that good for me. So, yeah, that is uh, my opinion right there, guys. Down to the meta rating. Meta rating card is going to be an 8.0 out of 10. And final rating will be an 8.5 out of 10. But anyway, guys, uh, that will conclude today's review. Hopefully, it helped you out in deciding whether you want to get this card or not. And you enjoyed this review. Before I let you guys, I want to say thank you so much for your support on Instagram and YouTube lately. I have been killing it with the support. And I love seeing that, guys. So, please take a second out of your day. Like this video. Subscribe to the channel. And expect a lot, a lot of Road to the Knockout reviews here on the channel. So make sure you are subscribed. This is Leo. I bid you goodbye and good night.